The commitment with the farmer with quality is very important for us. That was we start our process assessing the quality of the green coffee that we procure. We had different origins, we had different profiles in order for us to develop a good cup of coffee to the end consumer we need to understand what we have on the table. Roasting process is very important for the coffee processing because with this is when we develop the sensory profile that we desire for our product or is asked for one of our customers. We analyze every single coffee that we buy. The first step that we do is to smell the dry aroma of the coffee in order to identify the key attributes that each coffee should have. We pour the hot water to start the extraction process. After we wait for the four minutes to allow the extraction of the coffee happen, we are going to break the aroma. We are looking for aromatic, sweet aromatic, fruity notes, caramel notes that the coffee may have depends on the origins. We break every single cup and we have to clean the spoon every time that we are going to start a new cup to avoid cross-contamination between the cups. Once we break the cups, we need to clean the cups in order to be able to do the sensory evaluations. We use two spoons to remove the crust of the coffee. In coffee, you can find simple profile like clean, sweet and neutral and also you can find very complex profile with floral berry notes, caramel and cocoa notes, a wild and bold body. That is the science that we use to develop our, play, our blends. For tasting the samples we do twice. We taste the sample in a high temperature. We have to slurp. When we slurp, what we are doing, we are opening our taste buds and start feeling the basic flavors in coffee that it's acidity, sweetness, and start just scoring these coffees and identify the key attributes. I, I've been I've been coffee tasting for around 23 years, and definitely I love the coffee taste.